It's recording. Hey guys, so look at that. And these. <laughs> and this. And this. That was fast. And today, we're gonna do the jackpot and you don't it. One color, that's too purple. <laughs> okay, we're done with that. And now, let's get on to the next one. Glitter. Glitter. Pink. Wow. Ow. No Frankie. Okay, Mom. Guess what? Um, I need one more thing. Which is a slip glove. And I'm gonna be done. Just one more thing. Oh, shake it out. I'm gonna see if this is real. It's all about pinky. Ah. Children are watching Paw Patrol. Good morning, guys. I look ratchet. As usual, I start all the vlogs looking, you know, all kinds of cute. We got Aubrey putting makeup, Ezra and Elijah watching some YouTube. Um, I just figured out how to do parental controls on the Kindle, so I'm going to try to do that later. But today's agenda is to take down Christmas. Comment below if you usually take down Christmas before New Year's or after New Year's. I usually wait till after New Year's, but we decorated way earlier than we normally do this year too, so I'm kind of done. Like, I start thinking of my New Year's like goals or resolutions like super early, and I'm just kind of ready to have my house back in normal, even though it always looks so sad when Christmas comes down, but it's like pulling off the band-aid quick, right? Like, I just want to... Pull the mandate off and get my house ready and back in order. And I get a, um, I signed up for the Grove Collaborative. I get my box tomorrow and I really want to be able to like clean my house when my box comes. So I need to work on getting Christmas down today and laundry done today. So I'm going to take a shower and kind of get ready just so I don't look like this the whole day. And then um, get going on that let the kids play a little bit i would love to like kind of get their room back in order because it got crazy even though i like super cleaned it right before christmas um christmas just makes everything messy <laughs> so and then i want to make a good grocery plan list because we need to be really good about our budget for the next couple weeks well forever right that's part of my new year's goals too wait mom but, am i going to the grocery store probably I don't have any of the big kids, so you guys have to do everything with me this week. Yay! <laughs> Alright, and Brad's at work, and the Aubrey woke up this morning, and she's like, I'm going to keep Daddy's spot warm for him. So Daddy's at work. She's like, but the sun's not even up. <laughs> I was like, I know, that's when Daddy goes to work, before the sun even wakes up. So, I gotta get ready. I gotta get going. I need to find the motivation. Can I cry? Tell it, tell it, tell it. was gone and I love him. I know. Okay, so I am gonna take down Christmas in our house. Um, the way I do it is I pick a general area, which right now is gonna be in my kitchen. I'm gonna move this lighting, kinda sucks. Um, it's gonna be in my kitchen. And I am gonna, I pull everything down and stick it in one area. Then I bring all my totes and boxes in and I kind of, I kind of do like inventory of what I want to keep, what I can get rid of. Um, Ezra was playing with our new Hallmark ornament that we got for Christmas. Here, come on, let me see. Let me see. That's Aubrey. Um, the kids are playing kind of nice right now, so I'm going to really try to do this. So my plan for this week, let me see. For New Year's, we are going to stay 
in Oceanside with my kids who are dog sitting. Um, so I have today, which is Wednesday, Thursday, and then we leave on Friday. So I plan on doing laundry and taking down Christmas today, then cleaning and packing tomorrow, and <laughs> making a grocery list at some point. Um, so we can take food. This is where we stand. Because I guess I can't go out to grocery shop on base unless I have a military ID. So I'm going to take in my groceries. Um, but yeah, so here we go. Christmas 2017 is done and it's coming down. So follow me along. My kitchen is a thorough mess. I'm gonna make some lunch for these kids because we're all hungry. And then bring in my boxes to put this all away. I might have to wait to do the tree, the big, like taking down the tree because I might need Brad for that because I need big muscles. <laughs> no, I just need two of us to get the box down. So the tree might stay up until he gets home, but everything else will get put away. Okay, we have eaten and I have brought in all the Christmas and fall boxes because there was some fall stuff left out um, when I brought Christmas out. So I'm gonna go through those because we are probably moving in 2018 and I've realized I've accumulated a ton of stuff. I'm kind of feeling like this whole minimalist vibe. So I'm gonna go through all the boxes and see what's in it because it's all like decorations that I took down or decorations for Christmas that I didn't use. So obviously I'm not in love, right? So I'm gonna go through that, figure out what I'm gonna put in garage sale pile, throw away pile, whatever, and then only put away the things that I used this year that I love because if it doesn't, what is it? doesn't inspire, if it's not beautiful, inspire, or useful, get rid of it, right? So I'm on that kick right now, guys. So I'm gonna go through fall and Christmas and minimalize. Wish me luck. show you what progress is made. Those are all my Christmas bins minus a one. Those are all my fall Halloween bins. Everything's still out, but that's all gone through and empty to put this stuff away. So let's start.
battery died like halfway through, but look, I'm making progress. I'm making progress. But look what came. I'm gonna unbox this for you guys real fast. I'm so excited. This is my first The Grove collaboration box. And I am so pumped. I was texting a girl earlier today and I was like, I think I'm more excited for this box than I was for like Christmas. I love cleaning, I love cleaning supplies. Cleaning supplies and office supplies are like my jam. So here it is. I have bubble wrap, bubble wrap. This bamboo prep board was free because I signed up to become a Grove collaborative person. And so I got a ton of stuff for free. I got a free apron. How cute is that? I got a free pair of cleaning gloves. Those look nice. I got the Mrs. Meyer peppermint scent whole trio. So I got hand soap, um, all multi-surface spray. This will be the first time I've tried Mrs. Meyer's and I'm pretty stoked. And then dish soap. This was, that was all free when I ordered these next items. So I got the Method All-Purpose Honey Crisp Apple Spray. Look at that. And then I ordered the um, Spearmint Anti-Back Toilet Bowl Cleaner by Method. And I ordered this um, Lemon Ginger, it's like a um, squirt mop. So I'm gonna try that because I usually like spray my stuff and then mop with my um, mop that's broken because the thing broke, the like thing where I put the solution broke. So I have to spray something or squirt something and then mop. So I thought that would be perfect. I think that's it. Just making sure. Empty box. And what is all this? Like a welcome and whatever. So yeah, I bought these three things and I got these um, six, whoa. These six things for free. I'm so excited. So I was gonna wait until this all came to clean the house, but now that it's here, I think I'm gonna clean as soon as I'm done. That way tomorrow can be more of like just a chill day. I'm working on laundry, so we'll see how that goes. And I'm so excited. I've never tried Mrs. Meyer's stuff because my Target is always, always sold out. My um, Marshalls never carries it. Like this kind of stuff I know is a hot commodity and I don't go often enough to catch it, you know? So, especially the peppermint scent. I know Christmas is over, but I love the smell of peppermint like year round. So I'm so pumped right now. And then I wanna smell this. I wanna smell it. Cause I heard, this one's really good. Let's just, come on. Oh my gosh, this smells like, remember when Bath and Body Works had an apple and they had like apple hairspray? I used to get it. Um, like back in junior high days, that's what this smells like. Oh, so good, just like a super fresh apple. Let's see what this guy smells like. Oh my gosh, it's lemon ginger scent. So good, and then let's smell the Mrs. Myers. Oh my gosh, so pumped. It's like the good peppermint, not like the cheap peppermint. Holy cow, my house is gonna smell so good. I'm so excited. All right, I'm gonna get done. You need to charge some more, because I like pulled you off, because I was so excited over this. Okay, Christmas is down, and I would like to get this room back in order. That way, I could kind of make dinner and then just straighten up and clean. So I'm going to work on the kids room right now. Alright. It is all clean. I have some gingerbread um, oil diffusing and I've got the closet all clean. Their toys all organized and put away. And this pile of laundry to do. So it's actually everything has a home and everything's in its home. Even the new stuff they got for Christmas. Feels really, really good. Now I need to make some dinner for my family, and then I think I need to clean the bathroom. 
and I still have stuff to put away out there. But one room completely done, vacuumed, dusted. Looks good. All right, I am gonna clean this bathroom. I'm gonna use my new gloves. I'm super excited. I sprayed down and did the toilet bowl cleaner, did all that stuff, but I'm gonna clean it now. So what I do is I usually take just a hot water cloth and wipe down my couch. I need to vacuum and have baking soda on the carpet. And then I just need to give everything like a good wipe down dust. So that's what I'm gonna do. See what kind of mess my puppy made. It never fails. Puppies and toddlers, they destroy your cleaning. but Brad treated me by going and grabbing dinner. So I'm gonna pause, because who likes cold fries? Nobody. McDonald's? McDonald's? What's your best fries? What's your favorite fries? You got McDonald's, you got Carl's Jr., you got Wendy's. McDonald's and In-N-Out. In-N-Out. I like you, Chick-fil-A. No! <laughs> All right, we're gonna eat real fast. truck board there I'm gonna hang it up there and then look at my sweet hubby folding all the laundry I've been keeping the loads going but he's been folding and putting away because he's a G huh <laughs> on to the kitchen <laughs> 